Yosemite National Park has probably been the number one on my USA bucket list since before we even got here. But if you had told us that we would have one of the most insane experiences of our lives in this park, I probably wouldn't have believed you. The beginning of our California trip started in a pretty classic way. We climbed up the range to Sequoia National Park and saw the hugest, most majestical trees I've ever seen in my life. And it reminded me a lot of this. On the way down the range, we got caught out once again with the weather, not being prepared. First, it was rain. Then, and then it turned into snow again. When we finally made it to the warm sanctuary that was our campsite for the night, shock horror, things did not go to plan. Okay, hello everyone. We're currently leaving Sequoia National Park area. We went to our campsite and there had been like a accident on the like really muddy downhill that you go to get to the campsites. Oh my gosh, it's so dark. <laughs> It was like raining and the owner was like, you need to leave because we're trying to get this car out. And now we're heading towards Yosemite and it's currently 10 to 7 p.m. And this is literally our life. We never know what's going to happen. Even if we book a campsite, we don't know if we're going to get it. We ate our breakfast pretty happy with ourselves for finding our favourite view of the trip. <laughs> this is what I usually have for breakfast. And then spent the next few days exploring meadows and amazing views. Big bread. Oh my gosh, how Because it's thick bread. That is not thick bread, that's like normal size. It's thick. So juicy. Oh. <laughs> Right, Bailey's tasting gluten-free bread for the first time. Sandwich looks good though. Yeah, it does. Nice work. Thank you. Look at that. Why do you have to eat gluten-free bread? Yeah. Because <laughs> my body is freaked up. Because you're bulking too much? Yeah, I'm bulking too hard. I need to lose weight. <laughs> ah. Hey, you weren't meant to try it yet. That was the bum piece. <laughs> Oh, that's weird. How is it? Not too bad. Yeah.
Aza killing. <laughs> we met John and Katie, who were two buddies traveling around Yosemite at a sunset point the night before. They then asked us to go on a hike, and we started to get to know each other, talking about the most important things first, of course. We love uh, Danny's and IHOP. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, we don't have that in Australia. <laughs> That is so scary! <laughs> Guys, okay, I'm gonna tell the vlog. We're listening to the to the frequency of people climbing on El Cap and it's like dark hours while we're hiking down and a girl can't find her way on the right route and so she has to free climb part of it to get to the right spot. <laughs> Yay, she made it! I'm so happy. How'd you go, Great. Bailey? How'd you go, guys? Do you want to say uh, anything to the oh, vlog? I'm so tired. What's the time right now? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I think it's probably 10 o'clock. Yeah, 10 o'clock. Yeah. <laughs> it was brutal. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice work. Pretty light. Uh, good time. Yeah. Was it worth it? Well, it's a good question. <laughs> well, it was beautiful up there. Was yeah. it worth it for the photos? We'll see. But it was very nice up there. Yeah, that's, that's great. Sure. And it's a memorable experience. So. Oh, yeah. I love that. Okay, that's so great. But like, if someone was like, want to go back and do it again for the same photos, I'd say, you know, we can do something else, actually. <laughs> I agree. <laughs> no comment. Bugs. As usual, our plans and our trip has changed <laughs> last minute, but this time for the best reason. Um, so yesterday, or the day before, we made some friends. Um, their names are Katie and John, and they're really, really cool, and they're down for everything, and they love photography and adventuring, and we're really stoked to meet people who are just like so keen for anything. Um, but we found out yesterday that the Glacier Point Road is opening today just for bikes and we also found out that there's a super high chance of the northern lights in Yosemite so we're like well of course we have to stay another night we can't just leave because we we're meant to be leaving today <gasps> and we almost crashed <laughs> we've been racing around all morning trying to find bikes but we've also been trying to find everyone because we have no service and we've had to change our sim cards today so it's currently 1.30 and we found a place that lets you, lets you rent bikes overnight. And we're going there 40 minutes out of the park. Um, once we get there, we're gonna pick them up, bring them back, drive up to the side of the road, and then it's a 25 kilometer bike ride <laughs> to the spot that we wanna get to. So tonight we're bike riding 50 kilometers. <laughs> and uh, I don't, it's just crazy. I, yeah, I definitely haven't thought about this as much as what it's actually going to be like but anyways I'm very excited. <laughs> okay, our current dilemma is fitting these two bikes into this car with this much stuff. <laughs> this is our car. <laughs> oh my gosh I can't believe we're about to do this. I'm not mentally prepared to bike ride 50 kilometers right now but we're doing it, so. Yeah, two hours. What do you think, John? Yeah, like 2.15. Yeah. 
Two fifteen. What do you think, Katie? Six. Six. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I think. I think. Two and a half. Yeah. We're doing the test drives. Oh, yeah. I literally have not ridden a bike in so long. You're this is very confident, guys. <laughs> Look at me, though. I'm full riding a bike right now. This far, this slow. We have 10 miles to go. Out of 14. I thought it was a 16 mile, but it's actually 14. So it's not 50 kilometers. It's like 40 something. <sighs> Having a little walk. Ugh. My quads are dead. Bailey's. Everything. And especially his. My coccyx. Okay. <laughs> you know that one. All right. His butt. It's his butt. Bad picnic spot. Oh, so nice. Hello, everyone. It's a very exciting day because today we have finally turkey bacon. <laughs> We're gonna eat it here with this amazing view, and I'm the most excited. This is the no, this is not the highlight of my day because we're literally in Yosemite, but I'm so excited. And this is the view. Very excited. <laughs> yeah. Yes, sure, you can be the view. And also this. Cooking. Toast done. Cooking. Yum. Um there's just it's just everywhere. They love turkey here, which is so sad, but yum. this is so yum. Mm -hmm. I haven't really talked much to the camera while we've been here in Yosemite. I think just because it's so amazing and I just kind of like want to enjoy it. We were thinking maybe going to Big Sur and San Francisco. We literally have no plan. But our flight is leaving officially in 20 days from Portland to New York and then New York to London. So we're on the back end of the trip now, which is kind of really exciting, but also scary because we've also booked nothing for Europe. <laughs> So that's kind of just our life is just like going with the flow, but that's why it's cool because we meet people and If they invite us somewhere want to do something we can do it because we have that flexibility But yeah, we need to start booking stuff for Europe. But anyways, there's my rant Guys, there's a bear. There's a bear There's literally a bear Wow A bear Sucked. You can't really see it anymore. Oh, I just saw a bear. <laughs> That's so crazy. I've been so scared to see a bear this whole time. <laughs> but then I just saw one and oh my gosh, it was so cool because he was just chilling. It's just like walking away. <laughs> I know lots of people, so I'm safe. <laughs> 